the game of life i just started writing a small book on this very topic the game of life all of us wonder about this from time to time what is this life about what is this universe about why are we here what is the nature of reality and what is the purpose of all this these questions are not just for philosophers these questions are of all of us all of us deep within us truly want to understand the answer to these questions we wish to understand this reality we wish to understand this universe of course as we get involved with the activities of life these questions tend to fade away but these questions are never fully gone now after studying so many teachings and so many teachers and after uh, looking at this reality from a variety of perspectives i can confidently say no teaching or no book can explain the nature of reality as well as the ancient upanishads of india there are profound teachings on the nature of reality and the nature of self but the language of the upanishads and the structure of the upanishads are very different because it was written at a different time thousands of years ago so i thought why not simplify this teaching why not put it in simple language and explain it in a way through examples with which everybody can understand it so because of this i wrote my first book decoding god So when I was thinking about writing a small book on the nature of reality using simple language and a metaphor the game of life came to my mind and if we think about it this reality is just a game it's a simulation nothing is what it actually seems although the universe seems like it is an independent reality and matter has an independent existence in this time space reality this is actually not so according to the ancient upanishads and even according to modern science and quantum physics matter is nothing but energy and this time space reality itself which we used to think as an independent fundamental aspect of existence is actually not so and this is what some of the modern scientists are saying and this is what the upanishads said thousands of years ago so this universe is nothing but a game and before the creation of the universe before the creation of the game there was no thing as such there was pure potentiality and there was source all by itself without any manifestation and that source is the creator of the game the architect of the game and from that source came this universe in this way and this is simply a projection and a simulation and all of us do we think we are separate from each other we are simply avatars of the game and each one of us is being played by the source itself we are the source but right now we have identified ourselves with our avatars and we have identified ourselves with the skin with this body and mind and we think we are this limited body and mind but this is not actually true we are not simply the players of the game but we are the creators of the game now imagine how fun the game will be when we realize that we are the creators of the game and then play the game instead of of identifying ourselves as some limited character in the game and playing the game with all the limitations of that character and experiencing stress and frustration because of the outcomes of the game all the while never realizing that it is all a game so the first step for all of us is to realize that this universe is simply a game to be played then we can stop taking this seriously and simply play and have fun and then slowly after we disidentify ourselves with this character with this avatar of the game we will at one point realize that we are the source and we are the creator of this game and we were never 
the players we were never the characters of the game and that point will come to everyone said swami vivekananda so i hope that that point of realization will come soon for me and you and everyone so that we can stop these wars and these suffering that human beings have created for themselves i hope you found this interesting if you want to understand the nature of reality and if you want to understand the teachings of the ancient vedanta you can check out my book decoding god on amazon thank you for tuning in and i'll see you on the next one